Which of you five would like to play my little game? No, I can't give Glennis the fluid. If I revived her, I don't think I could stand to face her again after what I did to her. Oh. Well, that's extremely I'm selfish. I'm giving this away. If I'm gonna die, I'm taking everything with me. Right, okay. What about alcohol? I'm not giving this away. Oh. If I'm gonna die, I'm taking everything with stock. me. It's the stock thing. Yeah. So we need another organ. Edna knows the answer to this riddle. But we have to get her off this bleeding hook first. Do we just use the shovel on her and see? Is it? I think we're at use objects on objects. I don't know what to do with these. Yeah, snap. Is there anything around the top of her? I think as a, as a bit, yeah. yeah. Like, no... See, I thought there would be, but there isn't. Okay, anything on any of the walls which might indicate we could lower her down. What about the pipes? No, no, no. What's that? Um, what about that vent next to the... Okay, nothing there at all. Oh, man. Um... Hmm. I swear you should just be able to cut her down. Yeah, it makes sense, doesn't it? Like, she's hanging on by that little bit of hook. I just dull my knife. Like, I swear we've only used the knife, really, for any part of, any of this game. As well. You're going to shoot her. Oh. Okay. Oh. <laughs> I Did take that back. Really think I'd let you die <laughs> now when I've intervened every time you attempted suicide in the last 109 years? You can't skip this. No, Gorister, oh. I'm sending you back. So Am is torturing us to as well. So yeah. That you may languish in your guilt over and over again. This is a hell with no end, Gorister. <laughs> Who right. among you shall go next? They're just quicker to load and. Yeah. Do that business again. I mean, we were here. Yeah. So, the gun is a bullet that is so strong it explodes. It's a bomb gun. It's a bomb. It's a bomb gun. gun. Yeah, so don't use that gun. Alright. <laughs> yeah, Note that to not self. For use. Do not fire that gun again. It's just an immediate death. So, was it use magnifying glass on. Beef, We've done that, haven't we? No, I think. The oh are yeah, still okay. Inside. Further back. Reminds yeah. me of when Am ripped that hole open in Benny's chest. Of course, Am sewed him back up again before he bled to death. That bastard's never gonna let us die. He's just gonna keep torturing us forever. And then knife. On one heart. The knife it genuinely another. is being as useful as a knife is. Yeah. This is a realistic adventure game. <laughs> All problems no. are solved with the knife. <laughs> Except when they're solved by trading hearts with jackals. Ah, this is Edna's heart. A bitter organ, but worth its weight in gold. <sighs> I give you your heart back. Thanks. So how do I get out of here? A heart brought you here, but it will take another organ to get you out. If you can harness its power. I don't understand your riddle about another organ. Ah, but Edna does. And all the other animals like her. I've got nothing more to say to you. Right, should we just talk to Harry? Yeah, since we haven't talked to him in a bit, maybe he'll have something to say. No. Let me pour you a drink. What's this about a thunderstorm? You know... Yep, fair talk enough. Talk to you later. Thank you, Harry. I worry that it's gonna be like... Kill Harry. Oh. Okay, so what options do we have? We've got nothing that we seem to be able to use on Edna. We're also not allowed to talk to Edna. Um, what if we show Edna our heart? It's the only thing we haven't had since. Um, 
since we got in there the first time. Yeah, like it seems weird not to need it now. What good will that do me? <laughs> I'm not giving this away. Yeah. If I'm gonna die, I'm taking everything with me. Okay. I'm not giving this away. <laughs> if I'm gonna... Edna knows, but we have nothing more to say no, to her. She knows, like all the other you. animals. Like her. Like her. What does she know? I suppose you can like talk the to the pig, can you? Oh, pig, okay, again, sorry. The beef. beef, the beef, yeah. No, it doesn't come up as an option. <laughs> so the hotspots change depending on what verb you've selected. That's cool. Um, well, it is kind of, but it's also <laughs> a bit hard to tell. Too big to take with me. Yeah, I guess walk will show everything, ideally, or look will look will show everything. Why but walk push and look Edna? are connected. Is it as simple as that? Oh, can't push her. You can push Too the beef. Take with me. Use Edna. No. Look Damn at Damn things it. frozen solid. Look at Edna. That's Edna, uh. my mother-in-law. No, this is too good to be true. Hmm. Hmm. I guess you could always save and try um, doing something to the dad, but I don't get it. It's not very clear, is it? Yeah. I guess we also haven't tried walking out into the desert, but I'm a little bit worried about that just being death yeah cuz it just says you're going to get lost right that man says a storm's coming this heart is mine what whoa Uh... Hmm. I'm not I'll be sure. honest, I actually didn't think that would work. I'm not sure we should do that. It just seems brutal. <laughs> that did. did. No, no shit. Okay. I don't know. If that's a good idea. Okay. Sorry, I'll just skip over this stuff I should have saved. Right, so now we're at the same point, really, aren't we? Yeah, we have so a didn't... Isn't it so a bit premature to be digging your own grave, Gorester? So that's just a, gl a glitch. Maybe. In that the grave is there. Yeah, do you want to save at this point so that we can just have a spot yeah. to work from? I don't know what to do with this. The grave. What else could we do? I don't know what to do with this. Um... There's all that debris. I could. Hmm. I'm wondering if we could look at the debris with a magnifying glass. Yeah, that's a good, 
good shout. Let's take a look. He told us to look at it, like, and we didn't have that before. So. There's some hair that was pulled out during the fight. It's the same color as mine. And here's some that matches Harry's. Now I understand what happened here. I'm glad you do. What? Oh, yeah, it's walk. It's use one way, walk the other. Should we talk to Harry? Maybe the game will tell us what happened then. <laughs> right. Let me pour you a drink. <laughs> I was the one you killed, wasn't I, you bastard? I'm sorry, Gorister. Edna poisoned the punch, and after you drank it, I wrestled you to the ground. When the poison took effect, I cut you open. Why did you kill me? Oh, it's too complicated for me to explain. <laughs> You'll have to ask Edna. Okay. Talk to you later. Let's ask Edna. It was a good call, magnifying glass on the debris. Yeah, it was more again, like with all of these things, it's lack of options. Like... <laughs> <laughs> well, that's bitch. one approach. I know all about your plot to murder me. I had to make a deal with Am. I had to. I've always been harsh on you, I admit. But we're the last people on Earth. Let's help each other now. Why should I trust my own murderer? Alliances change, Gorister. Something's gone wrong. Am's two Conrads don't listen to me anymore. I need you. And you need me. It's that simple. Oh, okay, now we get an option to actually do the thing. Um, should I say that first? Yeah, I guess so. Wait a Got second, I say to you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> This game is evil. I ought to kill you right now, you bitch. Don't be a fool, Gorister! You need me alive if you want to make it out of here! Uh, uh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, can we not be horrible? You don't want to do cut her heart out or shoot her with the gun that explodes and kills everything. I definitely, yeah, definitely not the bottom one. Um, I don't even, yeah, definitely not the middle one either. Out of those. All right, we'll take her down. We'll take her down. Let, we'll be the good per. Well, we'll try to be good. -ish. We're good, Gorister. You truck driving son <laughs> of a bitch! This is for me and my baby. Let me go. Got you now, Chorister. And if you think you'll ever escape me, you've got some new thinking to do. Okay. Please, I'll do anything you ask. I don't know what's come over me, Chorister. Can you ever forgive me? I've been hanging here for so long, I'm not thinking straight. A sip of that milk will clear my head. Uh... What do you think? I... Oh, we're just gonna follow this rabbit hole? Mm, I don't think... She's messed up. They're all messed up. They're all messed up, yeah. No, don't give her anything. <laughs> no, I don't. No. no, I don't trust you. <laughs> Gorister, let me down or I'll scratch your eyes out, you worthless excuse for a man! Oh. <laughs> it's just having this conversation while she's grabbing me his face. Let me down. I'm your only hope of getting out of here. Uh, no, we're not. Sorry, Edna. Yeah. I don't trust you as far as I can spit. Let me prove my good intentions. I'll let you go. Now give me the key. 
Uh, you can tie her up with the rope. Yeah, that's less violent, I guess. It doesn't involve giving her one of our items. Untie me, you son of a bitch! <laughs> I'll rip your spleen out! I'm taking you with me, Edna. We do need her. We need to put her in that clamp. She went. <laughs> Where are we holding her? I don't see a lock. She's she's in she's in our pockets. She's in our infinite adventure game pockets. <laughs> All tied up. That's, I sort of that's so just... silly. I love it. <laughs> that that might be the best. Can we can we tell? Oh, no, we can't. Glennis, what has Am done to you, honey? I guess she's just there to make us feel bad. Yeah. I can't feel bad yet, though, because although I know he's obviously hit her or done something, did he really hit her so hard? Talk to you later. Oh, I don't know what happened. Maybe. I mean, I guess if if it got out of hand. <laughs> this is absolutely bonkers. I find it interesting as well, like, that they're using the, fra the, the words truck driving as some sort of insult. <laughs> like, you truck driving son of a bitch. <laughs> like, yeah. that's... I take, yeah, so you... it... I take it you're going to that door. Yeah, that's that was the plan. Oh, that's not where I wanted to go. <laughs> that's um, the plan. But Am has made you go up there. It's because the sweet spot for these things is... <laughs> bonkers. It's all the transitions, though. It's not items. Like, mm. when I've seen an item, I've been able to pick up an item. Sure. But <laughs> transitioning between screens is apparently the worst possible thing. So nice. many dials and controls. So how do I get out of here? So is this well, the... the... This is the cockpit. Yeah. Can we ask Edna, Edna wrote this log book. Oh. Can we read okay, it? can I can I yeah, I just want to read it. Edna wrote this it? log book. Use take. It's fastened to the cockpit with a damn wire. Oh, we've got nothing that could deal with a wire. Okay, we've got some log entries. When Am took us down here before the war, I didn't know anyone could hate Gorister more than me. <laughs> but Am did. He hated all of us. It's a weird entry. If I entry. can just deliver Gorister's soul on a platter, I can make amends for every minute of Glynis's life I took from her. I never meant to drive her crazy. I'll be damned. Edna's claimed responsibility for Glynis. Maybe it wasn't my fault after all. Smiling. I thought I could do what Am wants, but he's too precise. I poisoned the punch, but I couldn't bring myself to cut out Gorister's heart. Maybe I can have my husband do it. Then this Zeppelin can clear the mountains. But if we don't finish the job, Am will feed me alive to the machine just like an animal. Okay. So she let her husband cut out the heart. The ignition switch. Hmm. So how do I get... I'm just trying to find other hot spots. Yeah, pretty much. Okay. Oh. The light's dimmed. We must be out of power. Well, could we put Edna in the thing? Uh, yeah, let's. I mean, I, I guess in that. theory. I'll be damned. The engine's starting up again. Nice. Uh, Edna, 
It's good to finally see you doing something useful with those negative currents running through your brain. Right, so instead of these cages powering it, we're using her. Can we... I just want to know. No. Okay, so now the engine's up, the engine's up. Good to know. Um... Any ideas? Should we just... We're not getting much in the way of information, are we? Like, no. You just plugged her in like <laughs> a battery. <laughs> did, did, did you say, were you able to talk to her? I missed no, it. No, no. It just, um, when I talked to her, it just said, he just made a, a kind of snide comment. <laughs> Why would I talk to this battery? <laughs> finally using your brain for something useful. Oh, lovely. Uh, that's essentially the comment. You talk to Harry. Um, I've plugged your... Okay, no, that's not something I <laughs> can say. Guess what I did to your wife. Also, how is this happening in continuity? Like, they're acting like they did it. They cut out his heart. He has had his cart cut out. But has he been reinserted into, like, a past torture scene... Or a past event that he wasn't necessarily aware of, still within the place of Am back before when there were other humans being tortured. This that still what? sounds like they're talking about it like it's 109 years in the future, though. Hmm. So I don't really understand time-wise what's going on, like in terms of how is he walking around if they actually did what he uh, Am Everything asked to do. Right. Okay. I read Edna's logbook, and everything's much clearer. Now what? You must make amends and bury the past, Gorister. I've got nothing more to say. Oh, okay. Huh. Right, okay. Deal can't take you. Um. She can't talk. My God, what have I done? You try the milk on her again? We tried it before. Better stuff. No, not I you. But I feel sorry, stronger. Give. Yeah, sorry, not I keep you, thinking. You, Gorista. Stop drinking the milk. This fluid should revive you, honey. Okay. Glennis, all these years, and I thought I was the one who was responsible for your right. suffering. Right, okay. Let me help you now. She's gone. At least I finally made amends with her. I'm taking her body out of this freezer. So you're gonna bury her? In that yeah. grave? I don't know why we have to do this. It's just something he needs. To do. Yeah. Well, yeah. see, this green background behind green. him now it's is getting, getting greener. Green. Yeah. I feel like we're giving him sort of mental closure and. Yeah. Okay. I've made amends and buried the past. I've made amends and buried the past. An excellent job, Gorister. But the thunderstorm is upon us. You'd better hurry if you want to recharge your old ticker's battery. I've got nothing more to say to you. So, we need to put the heart back? Do we just fly off? 
Well, it's, it's making it sound like we need to put our heart. We need to connect our heart in. To where, though? To something. Maybe that's why it was at the front of the ship? Is there anywhere that lightning would strike? No, go back into the ship and I guess save so that we can play around a bit. Because, like, we plugged this in. Like, this is why I don't fully understand why we had to bury the past. Because, couldn't we, now that we've done all this, couldn't we just start the ship up again? Yeah, I, like, I'm. I think this is less of a objective of this is like yeah less a thing about f physically getting places and more seemingly about um you think this is all one big metaphor <laughs> well i think this is like some weird strange like yeah i think this is some strange like coming to peace with the stuff you've done Story. Well, have what done. good will that do me? I wanted to use it with the with the node. I don't know what there was a emergency inflation wasn't there there was an inflation up the top yeah like could we just get the ship sorted again I don't know if this is the right thing to do or not because the airbags are inflating so how do I get out of here okay well we've got power we've got power should we just take yeah. off? Yeah, let's give it a go. <laughs> we need to reopen it. Like... Alright, that's a pain. So, should we just. Just flip the switch? We're taking off. Okay. We're taking off. It's got this storm. Where else can we go? Like what? And now we're up in the air. Can we go back? Talk to Edna? Ah, oh, yeah, let's. <laughs> Not a battery powered friend. Edna, it's good to finally see you doing something useful with those negative <laughs> no. currents running through your brain. Is that literally the answer? Like, she's a battery because she's got... A brain. But specifically negative... But then she, neg batteries work with a negative and a positive. Don't they? Yeah. Mm. I think it's just that we needed to use a brain. <laughs> So the, the hint was we needed to use a different organ okay. to get out of here. Right. You can go out still. Yeah, I think so. We could go out before, right? What? Uh, hello. You talked to him. Do it, Gorister. Blow the place apart. You may never have a chance to do it again. Oh. How are we here? Do you want me to blow it up? Oh, I guess so. That's what he's saying, but... <laughs> oh, God. Hmm. Yeah. You're made of sterner stuff than I calculated, Gorister. Interesting. Interesting. Here! Here's a new burden for you while I attempt to resolve this miscalculation. 
Who among you shall oh. go next? Oh, we finished it. We done with Gorista? Yeah. What did we learn? Um. <laughs> what did we... For that desperate attempt to form some sort of cohesive narrative. He he restarted his heart. He oh, blew away his, the his, lightning. Yeah, he restarted his heart. He blew up his past. He made amends. It was just a big metaphor. It was a metaphor for absolving himself of the guilt over his wife. Yeah. Which it sounded like he still bears responsibility for, but possibly not as much as he initially thought, because it turns out that his in-laws were also guilty of something, though it's not really clear what. Like, they just drove her to insanity? Yeah. Just, I don't know, that they were he, that his mother-in-law was messed up in her own way. Hmm. Is that what we've learned there? I th I think so. But then, how is, and that's been counted as a miscalculation on Am's part. In that we, he succeeded in finding peace with himself. Yeah. Do you think there was ways of completing that without? Um. I think it, it would have just that. killed you. Yeah, I think it would have just killed you in some way. Like we would have got caught out somewhere along the line. If we had, because mm. I, there was no real you. We like lack of not knowing, not being sure what to do next led you right back down, and then the fox, the wolf, <laughs> sorry, the jackal gave us a clue to bury the past. But we didn't have to do that, right? I. But I feel like it was. You think it would have been stopped in some way if we hadn't gone back and done it? Yeah, like maybe he wouldn't have. I don't know. Maybe he just wouldn't have like blown blown it up, or maybe he wouldn't have. Oh, it's, I don't know. It's hard. Well, to... I guess he was willing to face his wife once he read the entries and discovered it was maybe not him that was responsible for the worst yeah. of what she went through. Possibly, still mm. very unclear. Like they just had a fight, and he hit her. I think is what he said, and then yeah. he used that, or well, that seemed to be the trigger for a downward spiral that then never ceased. 